So what's going on guys, my name is Defect Davis, I'm going to help you guys remove the mouse lag and mouse acceleration from the Black Ops 3 beta. Now I personally had this issue, I looked up ways to fix it and I found a way to fix it so I'm going to share it with you guys so you guys can actually have fun playing the beta without any weird mouse issues. So the first thing you're going to need to do is actually go to your desktop. Now, once you're at your desktop, go to the Windows logo in the bottom left corner and right click on it if you're in Windows 8 or 10. If you're in Windows 7, just click on it and then click Control Panel. From here, we're going to go to Control Panel and it showed up on either screen. So, once you're in Control Panel, go to the search bar in the top right corner and type Mouse. And then go to Mouse Settings. Move over to Pointer Options and make sure Enhanced Pointer Position is unchecked. Once that's unchecked, hit OK because... That's turning off mouse and mouse acceleration in Windows. But just because you checked that box doesn't mean that's completely gone. The next thing you're going to have to do is go over to this website. Now, I have a link to it down below. But from here, you're going to want to download this link right here. Once you download this link, save it to your desktop or wherever you want to save it. To me, I have it right here on the desktop. Now, what you need to do is open it up with either WinRAR or 7-Zip. I'm using 7-Zip for this. And find what operating system you have. If you're using Windows 7, Windows 10, or Windows 8, for me, I'm using Windows 10, so we go here. And then you want to look for which one has your scaling option. To find out what your scaling option is, just simply right-click on your desktop, go down to Display Settings. If you're in Windows 10, it will be right here, it will say 100. If you're in Windows 7 or 8, you have to look around for the option, it will be there. But I'm using 100% scaling, so from there... I would click the 100%, just double click on it, run it. It's going to change your registry key to completely remove mouse acceleration. Now that that's all done, we could go into game. Now, once you're back into the Black Ops 3 beta, what you need to do is hit M to go to your settings, go to options, and go to controls. Go down to look, set your sensitivity to whatever you would like, make sure free look is checked on, and make sure mouse acceleration and mouse filtering are all the way off. These are actually something that will mess up your aim, especially since we just turned off mouse acceleration and mouse filtering. I'm not sure how mouse filtering works, but it really does add a bit of delay and stuff. Now, once that's all checked, what you, the next thing that's actually really important is to go over to your video settings. Make sure your video settings are some place where your computer can handle it. Personally, me, I have a 980Ti and a 5820K processor and 16 gigs of RAM, so I can run this game on max settings. Now, the trick to this is getting your settings into a playable frame rate. For me, if I don't have my FPS capped, I get about 160 frames a second, which is really bad because there's a big variation in frame rates at times. I could go from 160 to, like, 100. So what you really want to do is cap your frame rate at something that you have most of the time. So I capped it at 120, some people cap it at 90. There's a whole bunch of options, even cap it at 60. What I recommend is just keep turning down the textures until you have something around 90, 120 FPS. Even if you have to downsize your resolution, I have a 144 hertz monitor, so I want to keep it in the 120 range just because the game looks a lot smoother. After you do all of that, go in game and play because your mouse sensitivity and mouse lag, mouse acceleration, everything should be fixed and you should have fun playing the game. If you guys did find this video useful, leave a like on it, it really does mean a lot to me. Tell me down in the comment sections below if this did work for you or if it did not, I would love to know. But anyway guys, I'll see you in the next fucking video.